Hi, this is Nathan, your neighborhood arcade and pinball talk guy. Today we're going to be reviewing a virtual pin game called The Adams Family, and this is actually the uh, collector's edition version of this game. Uh, with that being said, please look for a review underneath the description of the video. Please like us on Facebook, Facebook uh, on, under Facebook Arcade and Pinball Talk. Uh, subscribe on YouTube, as well as follow us on Instagram under Arcade Pinball Talk. Let's go ahead and get this review underway, shall we? Have a nice swim. Table speed on this one's very fast, and as you just saw, that loop around right there, that's why that flipper is up at the top right of this uh, table, is uh, that, that basically hook that comes all the way around it is super fast, and it is aimed right down the middle. I'm trying to bonus here. There we go, got a little skill shot of 2 million on that one. But yeah, there's a lot of blocks to this game, as you can see on here. Right now, it's going up where the bumpers are. And uh, there's obviously, uh, I think that's Uncle Fester that's right in the middle. Right there. And table layout's good. I mean, look at the colors. I mean, you could, you could, uh, you know, obviously this is a virtual represent, a virtual representation of this table, but uh, you can see the draw to this table. I mean, look at the different layers. You got the steps up in the back. Uh, it's, it's just a moderate difficulty. See, it just goes right up there. Ball speed isn't too bad. There you go again. So that seems like an easier shot here. So far, just moderate difficulty on this table, and that's probably what the draw is of this game, is that it's not super hard to play, anyone can play it. And this is an older table, of course. And for it being older, you know, it's definitely laid out pretty good. Ahead of its time, actually. Paddle gap's not too bad on this, as you can see there. As I say that, the ball comes right down the middle at me. But uh, anyway, something to note is that you have a bumper to the right of the staircase and you have a, basically a, a, a block to the left. Uh, so hitting that, that bumper to the right is obviously there for a reason because that allows you to, that allows you to uh, have that ball come right back at you right down the middle. Just scored another skill shot. Let's see if we can do it again. There we go. Got this down. There we go. Yeah, the the, the pinball was obviously uh, upset with me hitting uh, every skill shot that you could have all at once. Got me up to 48 million though, so I'll take it. But anyway, yeah, the table layout is great. I mean, look at the colors of this thing. Themes there. You have the Adams Family music playing in the background. Um, you know, it's 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 definitely taking you back to Morticia and Uncle Fester and the whole the whole grid there. Definitely a fun game. You know, that's one thing about virtual pinball games is that I mean, if you look at this, I mean, it is a very 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 close representation of the Adams Family, the actual mechanical game. And so that's one thing I want to note on here is the fact that, you know, virtual pinball allows you to play games that you not normally would be able to find out in public because these games are hard to find. Once they stop production of them, I mean, there's only certain people that have it. One thing I do want to note is uh, obviously the middle there, it says the power. Uh, there's obviously a magnet under there uh which is directing the ball. So if you notice, if I go over that area, the ball actually causes it to go left and right and just jump around the table. And uh, this is kind of similar to what happens on Metallica with Sparky, is uh, the fact that there is a magnet that is controlling those balls and causing them to go multiple different directions. But as you see here, the ball response is really, really good on this. Uh, you know, flipper response is really good. This is a great table.
Replayability. Well, I mean, I've played the Adams Family in, in, in a mechanical format, and even that, you know, although it wasn't rated in the nines like some of the games that I played, I mean, the Adams Family is a solid, solid pinball, no matter which way you look at it, uh, in, a, in a virtual format or a mechanical format. I hope that if you get the option to play virtual, uh, I would hope that you would go out and you would you would try to find one of these pinballs and play it in person because you know there are definitely some subtle uh, differences uh, like yeah, obviously the uh, the cabinet shaking stuff of that nature the ball reacting I mean there's things that a, a virtual just cannot do but for a representation of what the actual physical one is this is a great great example. And the Adams Fame is just one of those tables that I would I would just highly, highly recommend you play. It's one of the better ones. There's a lot of tables out there. It doesn't necessarily mean they're all good. Replayability on Adams Family is going to be very high. Fun factor of the Adams Family. Who doesn't love Uncle Fester? I'm sure most people watching this right now, if you are watching it, you remember the old days. Uh, playing Uncle Fester's Quest on the Nintendo and the Adams Family in black and white and the whole nine. Uh, so, you know, there's a lot of history behind the Adams Family and uh, I'm pretty happy about the fact that the Adams Family is coming out with another uh, kind of cartoon movie here shortly, just a little off subject, because again, Adams Family is a great kind of storyline. Let's get another skill shot here, shall we? There we go, another five million. Great game all in all. Definitely one to check out. Uh, please, please like us uh, on Facebook, Arcade and Pinball Talk. Please follow us on Instagram, Arcade Pinball Talk. And please let your fingers slide off. Click that red button. Click subscribe. So that way you can follow us. We have a lot more content coming. But anyway, we thank you again for your time today and uh, appreciate it all. But anyway, we look forward to our next video with you.